Hello everyone and welcome back to Inspector Waffles. We are at the Maple Market. Spotty, you know the rule now. Only one person inside Maple Market. Aw, but I'm not a person. I'm a dog! I mean, uh, that's a stupid rule. I didn't want to go in anyway. Perfect. Just wait for me at the street lamp right there. Sure. Stay still. Just stay. Stay. Be a good dog. I won't move, Inspector. Good. See you soon. Hello, sir. My name is George. How can I help you today? We have a buy two, get one free deal on pineapples today. Don't miss out on these incredible deals. Thanks, but I'm not here for pineapples. Welcome back to Maple Market. I didn't go anywhere, sir. Um, okay, let's talk to him about groceries. How could I help you? You see, the victim and the victim's brother, Irwin, both had a secret grocery list hidden inside their houses. And it's a very weird grocery list, too. So we're going to see if this is the clue to something. I'd like a salmon, five mouse tails, duck grease, one club mackerel, and three lobster tails. That's a very particular order, sir. I know, right? Are you sure you want these products? Yes, and in this exact quantity. We are the lions! We are the lions! Oh, uh, right. We are the lions! You can go, brother. The assembly will start soon. Of course, that's why I'm here. I can't wait to see the other lions. Yes! So that is super exciting. The, the grocery list was actually the passcode to get into a secret organization. The lions. So in chapter three, we're going into the lion's den. I have no idea where I'm going. I am so confused right now. Apparently, there's a group called the Lions, and they're meeting underneath the city. Yeah. The cashier was acting strange when he started talking about the Lions. It's so weird. Yeah, let's find out what they're doing here. This case is taking an unexpected turn. Yeah, it looks like they're in the sewers, and there's a secret entrance at a grocery store. I'm glad it's... Got the electricity here. Yeah. What's this? A pizza box? Fresh slice of pizza! Hmm. Maybe somebody who lives in the sewers ordered pizza. Like the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I bet it was them. Heh. Who knows? Maybe the cashier comes here to eat. So many mysteries in this city. Yeah. Just a very mysterious city. Okay. So this is going to be a puzzle door. It's locked. Unfortunate. Uh, there's a key in the lock, but it's on the other side of the door, and that's no good. So we're gonna go over here. I think we've got some items. Ugh! Tunnel's full of rats! I'm still not sure if I should be afraid of them or not, or if I should chase them. I guess that's what the old cartoons from my childhood always said. Yeah, so it's weird. These rats are just like normal rats. Like, the dogs and cats can talk, but the rats can't? What's up with that? Spoiled milk! Fresh milk got dumped in the sewer! Makes me sad you didn't deserve that milk. Ooh, and a magnet. Here's an item we need. It's a magnet between the trash bags. That's a pretty good shape. Ugh, it's one of those modern magnets that has a specific number of uses. Okay, so some years ago, magnet manufacturers were unhappy because whenever you buy a magnet, it lasts forever. If you have one, you have no need to buy another one. That's bad for the magnet business. So the magnet magnates decided to make limited use magnets and I hate them. This one only works three times. I mean, it's better than nothing, but that's still garbage, right? Full of garbage. And what's this? Oh, bull ball card! Oh, it's a common one. That's not very rare. Oh, good thing it's in the sewers. But I'm gonna keep it. It could be useful. I'm still just, like, collecting bull ball cards for my, uh, album. Can I see my album? It's a pretty cool album. Anyway, <clears throat> So, let's solve this puzzle. I think I need to put, like, a piece of paper on the ground, or I use a magnet on the key? The inside key is too big, and it won't fit through the lock. Hmm, but the magnet could be useful. Okay, so I'll try this key. Ah, maybe the police station key will work. 
Okay, push the key out of the lock, on the ground, to the hole, and now I'll use the magnet. So that's how we solve the puzzle. Use the one key on the lock and then the magnet on the hole. It worked! The magnet lost a charge. Only two charges remaining. And let's just use this sewer key. Yeah, the door's unlocked. You know, this could have been avoided if I was bigger and stronger and could knock down doors by myself. I'd love to be able to break down a door, but alas, I'm a small cat. At least I can solve puzzles. Hmm, okay, this looks like some sort of ladder. So this started with a grocery list, and now I'm going deeper in the sewers. That's an inspector's life sometimes. An adventure full of surprises. It's a living. You only live nine times. Because I'm a cat. Yeah, I knew the sewers under Cat Town were huge, but I wasn't expecting this. I'm fine as long as I don't have to go into catacombs. Catacombs. <laughs> Wait, what's that costume? It's a lion costume. We are the lions. The lions. So, they think they're better cats than everybody else? I wonder if this is a cult involved with Fluffy's death. Or something larger. Maybe they're trying to take over the city. There's only one way to find out. Wow, this costume looks terrible on me. I'm not comfortable wearing this mask. I feel like an idiot. Well, more of an idiot than usual. I really hope I'm not the only one dressed like this. Scrap of material. Colorful material. Is it a clown? I hate clowns. Mm, maybe I'll we'll have to come back to grab that later on. And a tissue. Cold and greasy like breakfast leftovers. Yeah, oh man, it's disgusting. Anyway, I'm not gonna touch it. That's gross. So let's meet the lions! I really hope they find a way to heat this place. Yeah, I want to get the flu. You think we'd be refunded for medical expenses? Good question. You should... SILENCE! Thank you, brothers, and thank you for being here after what has just happened. I'm deeply sorry to share that number three was murdered yesterday. Ooh, really? That's so sad. Number three was a devoted brother and helped us become stronger than ever. We are the lions! We are the lions! He told me long ago that if anything should happen to him, he wanted me to reveal to you all who he really was. And so today, in light of these terrible circumstances, I can tell you number three was Fluffy, CEO of Fox Furniture. Woo! Ah, so Fluffy was in the lion cult. Fluffy was one of us? I never would have guessed. I love his boxes so much. Oh yeah, me too. What a loss. Silence! Must you comment on everything I say? Thank you. His death, regrettable though it may be, does not change our plans. We are going to dominate Cat Town! We will reign supreme over the city. We are the lions! We are the lions! Yep, so the cultists are totally planning to take over the city. That's not good. That's bad. Before we see our goal to its fruition, I have more bad news to share. There is a snitch among us. I will spare you the suspense. Fortunately, we caught him before he could spread word about us. Good. Our secrets cannot be shared. And surprising to me, it was someone close to our dear Fluffy. His own brother, Erwin! Woo! Betrayed by his own brother, incredible. I don't know what I'd do if my brother ever betrayed me. Hmm, never play with him and his favorite toys again? No, nothing like that. I'm not that heinous. Erwin is a prisoner in our back room. Some of our brothers are interrogating him now. Believe me, you don't want to see his face right now. We are the lions! We are the lions! Erwin's here. What did they do to him? It sounds like they're torturing him. Anyway, as you may have guessed, we need to find a new number three. Who wants to submit a resume? Me! But I don't have a resume with me, sorry. Okay, fine. Uh, why do you think you're a good candidate? Dear leader, whatever the situation, I always land on my paws. Woo! That's impressive. I know, right? And you, what about you? When I see objects on the edge of the table, I can resist, and I don't push them off! Whoa! Wow, how's that possible? You're a wise cat with a lot of self-control. How are you physically able to do that? Okay, 
Are these cats stupid or just lunatics? Either way, I've got to rescue Erwin and leave this place as soon as possible. Yeah, that's our, uh, our new clue. The secret cult in Cat Towns Underground. Apparently, they think Erwin is a traitor, so they've kidnapped him. Oh, man, this mystery just keeps getting more and more mysterious.